Welcome to County Office, your complete guide to local government services and public records. Let's start learning. How can someone become a foster parent for a pet at an animal shelter? Are you an animal lover looking to make a difference in a furry friend's life? Becoming a foster parent for a pet at an animal shelter is a wonderful way to help animals in need. Here's how you can get started. 1. Research local animal shelters. Start by finding animal shelters in your area. Countyoffice.org is a great resource to locate shelters near you. Source, countyoffice.org, https semicolon slash slash www.countyoffice.org slash animal dash sh elter slash. 2. Contact the shelter, reach out to the shelter and inquire about their foster program. They will provide you with all the necessary information and requirements. 3. Attend an orientation. Most shelters require potential foster parents to attend an orientation session. This is a great opportunity to learn more about the responsibilities and expectations of being a foster parent. 4. Complete an application. Fill out the foster application provided by the shelter. This will help them understand your preferences and match you with the right pet. 5. Home visit. Some shelters may conduct a home visit to ensure that your living environment is suitable for a foster pet. 6. Training and support. Many shelters offer training and ongoing support for foster parents. They provide guidance on pet care, behavior, and medical needs. 7. Choose a pet. Once you're approved, the shelter will work with you to find a pet that matches your lifestyle and preferences. 8. Provide a loving home. As a foster parent, your role is to provide a safe and nurturing environment for the pet. Give them love, care, and attention while they wait for their forever home. Remember, being a foster parent is a temporary commitment, but the impact you make on a pet's life is everlasting. So why not open your heart and home to a furry friend in need? Take a look at the links in the description below to learn more. If you have any questions or want to share your thoughts, leave a comment. We're here to help. Thanks for watching our video. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below. We'll see you in our next video.